Hello everyone, welcome to Asile Project Management course using Jira tool. Introduction to Jira. What is the features of Jira tool? Here we are talking about the Jira tool. First, let's talk about the features of Jira tool. Jira is a issue tracker tool. Remember one point here. When you are working with your Jira tool, everything will be considered as an issue. When you are saying the defect, defect is an issue. When you are saying that requirement, requirement will be considered as an issue. So each and every item in the tool, in the Jira tool will be considered as issue. That is why Jira is called as issue tracker tool. When I say that issue, issue is nothing but work needs to be done from the person that can be developer that can be tester that can be any other team member so when i say that issue say for example if you are testing your application you are finding some defect what you will do you will be reporting that defect to your developer in jira terminology we will say that i reported one issue to the developer that means developer has to work on that issue so it is a issue tracking tool each and every item in the tool will be considered as issue that is the reason this is called as issue tracker tool jira is issue tracker tool and jira is a simple web based applications that means you will be getting some uh, url from your leader manager you can open that url and you can use your login credentials to log in into your Jira and then start working. It is a simple web based application and you will be learning how to install Jira, how your Jira URL looks like that you will be learning in the upcoming sessions. And this Jira is a licensed product from Atlassian. Atlassian is the owner of Jira tool. However, for your practice purpose, if you want to take the trial, yes, you can use trial for few days and you can understand the complete tool, what is Jira and then how to work with Jira with your uh, free trial version. Once you go to the organizations and you will be using your license version. There is no much difference using your free trial and your uh, licensed version. So for our practice purpose, we will be using some trial account and you will be learning all the features with respect to Jira tool. And this Jira tool is very effective when you guys are using your Agile Scrum methodology. Agile Scrum is really powerful nowadays to implement any project. If you see in the current market, most of the projects are developing using this Agile Scrum methodology. If you are implementing Agile Scrum methodology, for developing your applications, then Jira is one of the best tool to manage your project. Jira is not the defect tracking tool. Jira is the project management tool. When you are working with any project, so if you want to manage that project, then you can use this Jira tool to manage your project from beginning to ending. And as I said, Jira is also useful for your uh, bug tracking. That means if you want to report the if you want to report the defects to your developer, then you can use this Jira for your bug tracking. So Jira can also be used as bug tracking. Basically, Jira is a project management tool. That means you can manage your project. Meaning, developers can use Jira, testers can use is, is can use Jira. So Jira can be used by any project team member because it is a project management tool. So say for example, if I'm a tester, I wanted to report a defect, then I will go to the tool and then I will create an issue and report it to my developer. And, and if you're working with your uh, any project and if you want to work with any task, what you can do is you can simply create the issue with your Jira because Jira is an issue tracking tool. And one more thing is, this Jira is also having the capability for reporting. 
this will create a very beautiful reports so end of the day end of the project if you want to see the project status like what is the status of my project how many issues we resolved and how much work we have done if you want to know the status of your project you can have so many reports in your jira i will be talking about a few reports going forward this is one of the cool feature with your jira is reporting you will be having good feet good reports and all these reports are very user friendly and this will this reports will give the information about your project status and one more thing you can also integrate this jira with any other tool say for example if you guys are using zephyr for your test case management so i am maintaining all my test cases in my zephyr tool then what you can do is you can integrate jira with your zephyr tool you can integrate jira with your jenkins so integration jira with some other tools it is it is possible and you can also use this integration for your effective testing like i wanted to manage my test cases with the zephyr and then i wanted to use jira for my project management then if you want to link jira and zephyr it is possible so when you are doing this kind of integration then you are doing even more effective work with respect to your application and these are all the features of jira like jira is a issue tracker issue tracker tool it's a web based application it is a licensed product from atlassian and scrum model means most of the organizations they will prefer to go with the jira tool jira is one of the best tool in the market nowadays and it can also be useful for your bug tracking and also you are having the reporting mechanism as well in the jira and one more thing is jira is one tool but you can use this tool for many users like not only for your bug reporting see i'm a tester so if i want to report my defects i can use my jira tool report, to report the defects and then say for example if you want to maintain your requirements now my client gave me some new change request change request is nothing but new enhancements to your application when when you are getting any change request from your client what you can do is you can maintain your change request in the jira itself now my client said that he wanted to implement one uh, one more extra requirement and he gave that uh, extra requirement that is called change request you can also maintain this change request in your jira as i said jira is one tool but you are having so many users with that single tool itself and anyone can use this jira like your support team can use this jira customer care team can use this jira and project management team like your project managers can use this jira and here you can also track the task task is nothing but say for example you are saying that you are reporting one defect to your developer that means what your developer will do developer will create one task saying that bug fixing for that particular defect and he will track that task when he started that task when he is finishing that task what is the estimates for the task each and everything can be done with your jira everything you can manage all the requirements and you can also maintain your workflow like how my issues will be resolved so my issue will be initially it will be open and then it will go to my developer my developer will fix it tester will retest test, tester will test that uh, issue tester will test that particular requirement if everything is going good he will close it else he will reopen that issue so here what you can do is you are having a workflow in your jira and this workflow if you want you can also customized according to your organization and your requirement as well so as i said earlier this jira is a single tool but you can use in so many ways and so many teams can use this jira tool 
so that's it for the for this session team thank you all